Colin Daniel here from the Next Issue Podcast. On today's video, we'll be doing a review for Sword of Asriel number one. This is a new series by DC Comics following up from the events of Soul of Asriel, Dark Knight of the Soul, uh, which also releases this week. Uh, that collects some stories from the Batman Urban Legends. So make sure to go read that if you want to kind of get caught up. Uh, but in this issue, let's talk about the creative team first. Uh, this is written by Dan Waters with art by Nicola Sismeshiha, uh, Marisa Luis on colors, and Hassan Otmani Alao on letters. Uh, really cool variant covers. Uh, we'll see some of those at the end of the video, including one by Joe Quesada, uh, who is one of the creators of uh, Asriel in his uh, original form, John Paul Valley. Uh, so let's talk a little bit about this. So Asriel is one of my favorite characters just because he looks so freaking cool. His original form and... Uh, you know, from Night Quest all the way to now, uh, he is the Angel of Vengeance. Uh, so, <clears throat> in this issue, the warrior Angel of Saint Dumas returns. Jean Paul Valley does not want to be himself away. Uh, does not want to be Astral ever again. All it has brought him is pain, violence, and misery. He has sequestered himself away at a monastery in Europe to find peace. But when a young woman who claims to have the same system programming that made Jean Paul Valley into Astral. Uh, arrives at the monastery, he won't have a choice but to don his violent mantle of Astro once more to protect her from the deadly assassins who wish her harm. From the Rising Star creative team of Dan Waters and Nicholas Sistema. Uh, so, yeah, I'm really excited. This is going to be a really cool mini series that will redefine Batman's world's most iconic, fierce character, uh, which is Astro. So, let's take a look at some of the art and we'll go from there. Uh, so here we see the opening shots of this, and I really love the art and how it's put together. I think one of the main things is that in order to portray Jean-Paul Valley, you have to really make him look like a troubled character. And we see that here with this long, you know, big establishing shot, uh, the narration, uh, the, the words that are catching you up. We see this uh, zoom in on the hands with the, with the rosary. Uh, we see him talking to some monks at the monastery. And just all these little things, the little clues, uh, the angle from below, and just the fact that we never really get to see his eyes uh, because he's wearing glasses. That really, really adds up. Uh, and I just love that immediately Trouble finds Asriel or uh, John Paul Valley. Things start getting uh, troublesome. I love the lettering here as well. This big let me go, like just emphasizing. Uh, like whenever a uh, word turns red, that means there's more emphasis on it. Like. It really helps you as a reader. And I love this last panel. The art here is so stylized, so dynamic. I love the panel layouts. You see here at the bottom where he calls him a sinner. And it's very, because of the movement, it's very fluid. There's not a lot of detail, which I really, really like. Um, it's very exaggerated, which I really like. And I love this other page as John Paul, he doesn't mean it. Uh, you know, he this guy comes back and actually hits him back harder. You see this massive blood just coming out uh and really really cool stuff uh and the whole book kind of continues throughout that stuff so i really really enjoy this book uh i can't wait for the rest of the series as i mentioned astral has been one of my favorite characters uh and we'll see some really cool variant covers at the end of the at the end of the video but let me know what you guys think i know there's a lot of batman titles going on but i am never gonna turn one uh uh, this one, you know, it's in the Bat family, if you will, as John Paul Valley has been Batman in the past. Uh, so, very excited for that. As always, thanks for watching, everyone. Remember to share, like, subscribe, hit the bell so you know when we go live. That is most Sundays, 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. Stay tuned because we have more comic reviews, trailer reactions, TV recaps, all that fun stuff here in the channel. Bye bye.